what is up guys shotgun here and welcome back to another video so today guys we are back on cosmic and in today's episode guys i just want to quickly give you guys a little update on what we have so far before we actually get right into it so i just quickly do slash pv1 i actually have a really dope helmet that i'm gonna actually start working on pretty soon but a lot of the enchants on it like in light and wonder actually max out which kind of sucks especially with dodge so i think we may have to throw this guy away but for now it has drunk for overload 3 and overload 3 is actually health boost 3 for your treasure rules players basically gives you extra hearts Strong 4 is basically play mill and I guess enlightened is blessed so I guess that does help out a lot for the guys who don't actually know that but we've also got lucky 10 on this which is max strong 4 overload 3 is max as well but for the most part not everything on there is max especially because there's so many enchants in there that I guess it kind of is still worth holding on to for now because you can only get 9 per piece I do believe and that thing right there has 11 I think it's from a special GK or something I ended up buying it on AH so if I do slash about real quick you guys can see I have 655k actually currently the richest player on the server and I do have I think you've got 7 blazes in my PV I think Ez has about 8 in his and then Vic also has like 5 in his PV so I guess we do have a lot of blazes and whatnot. I also did give Ez all the cave spider spawners and whatnot to mine up I think I got like one flowing somewhere in the PV but apart from that we do also have something really cool which I want to show off in the start of the episode so we actually have one of these guys I have a crap ton of money by the way and PV is full of gear but I guess you guys don't really see the PVs because it's just random gear that I don't haven't really looked at but yeah I guess for the most part it does all look cool I didn't actually redeem all the titles because I do have a few duplicates which I guess I'll just sell on the AH or I guess donate to a few of the faction members we actually have a mystery mob spawner so these guys over here are actually worth a crap ton of money so what you actually do with these guys is right click them and you can get any of the spawners listed right there so obviously Gas and IG are worth the most on the server right now and I actually do believe Gas are worth more than IG on this server so IG's so I think that is definitely something worth noting for now right guys right before we actually go ahead and jump down there I just want to quickly go ahead and do my stash enchanter and actually try and grab a few things from here because as you guys know I actually did grab a crap ton of XP from the last episode so currently we have 5.7k XP which is equivalent to one ultimate book so I don't really want to go for that I'd rather buy two elite books actually that honestly isn't too bad at all can I buy anything else simple or can I buy another simple might as well just spam out all our XP for now then okay I can't so let's open the simple first you literally get nothing good from this nutrition one and dodge two none of those are maxed out so nothing really too good there I'll actually go ahead and tinker those guys later guys what we're actually going to be doing in this episode is actually we're going to go ahead and try and kill a few people in the GK gear and if we can actually grab the GK gear because as you guys know selling gear early on on the server is the best way to make money especially in cosmic with the g kits if you sell down a h you can make so much money so we actually do want to go ahead and try and grab a few of those things and obviously we are still the richest players on the server not even the richest player i'm currently i currently am the richest player on the server so i don't really need to do this but i do want to go ahead and stock up on gk gear for bosses cots and all of that good stuff it's pretty much essential on here if you don't want to die in your max set because using a max set on here you usually want to do when you're actually fighting with teams because you do get ganked quite often so yeah you do want to use gk gear a lot there is actually quite op on here and you do want to use them for bosses and costs like i said so yeah either way we are going to go ahead and just head down here if we do find something we don't really want we can't always just sell it on ah or do it to a different faction member obviously vico is but for now let's just get right into this thing and i'm actually sorry if i do if my commenting is kind of off or something because i actually did just get back from school it was pretty much a really long day i was so tired but i did want to actually get on cosmic and record a video just because okay there you guys just killed this guy because he might have something on him he had some xp so he killed the noobs but it was <laughs> literally 21 xp i don't actually know what's going on over here but i think this guy right here is actually in one of the really op factions the server yeah selfie they're actually the second dominating faction right below us currently so probably don't want to attack him because his whole faction is online and they're all right next to him looks like his friend's gonna follow me out though so if this guy tags me then I guess we pretty much do have a reason to jump on him. Okay, let's quickly eat up a gap real quick. And we actually did take out. Alright, he's backing off. Let me. Okay, yeah, I'm not even going to go in. If you want to team up, message me or one of the mods. Yeah, that's actually the owner of Selfie. But this guy, is he going to. Alright, calm down, dude. I don't really want to team with you, especially gang people with you. But this guy could try and betray me at any second. Now, the only reason I'm not going to fight him is because. He's actually got his whole faction online right now, and his whole faction has G kits. So, if I actually was with everyone currently, then I'd probably jump on him. But for now, let's just fly away from him because I don't really want to get ganked. But either way, let's actually go ahead and see what's up over here. Then, so we've actually got the side of the walls, and this is where people should be redeeming their fallen heroes or whatever. So, let's actually just try and see if we can locate anyone. We've got a guy, I to make his nature at 3, which is definitely sick. 
Wait, you said office, so 96%, so passive sword and enchant temporarily freezes or quickly go and it freezes all enemies in a massive area around you, pushing them back and dealing massive nature damage, so I actually don't know how you stock up on souls, I'm still kind of new to that aspect of it, but actually, that might not be a bad shout on actually trying to pick that thing up, so over here we've got a kit, Hurric tricks the G kit, so I'm actually not sure if that's even worth the 200 key right there, but right click to right click this gem to unlock. So as you guys can see, if I just quickly go G kit real quick, what was the actual thing for that one? I think it was a wait. Did someone buy it? Wait, wait. <laughs> did it just get sold as soon as I got out of there? There's no way. Wait a second. It was a diamond. I'm pretty sure, but alright. It looks like that thing got sold. I think unless I'm just really stupid, but. Here we go, this is the GK right here somewhere, I think it's this one, no it's not. Alright, either way it's one of those GKs right there, either way all you have to do is right click the gem, and once you do that you can just discharge GK like I just did, and at the GUI you can click on the GK and unlock it for you, and you can do it every 3 days. See, so yeah, it looks like this guy just picked it up. So yeah, it looks like it did get sold, I was going to message him and say, yo, can you reduce the price a little bit, I might actually go ahead and buy that, but... Looks like he actually, I guess, got it sold really quickly, which is kind of sick for him. Just saw this guy jump off at Icy Plains Warp, so I'm actually going to go ahead and jump odd trim and see where he's actually trying to go. So, he's actually going to drop somewhat quickly. He's on 16 already, yo. We're actually going to get our axes level up fighting this guy, so let's actually stick on him. He might have some G-Kick gear on. I actually think he does. So, oh, there you go, right there. Easy kill, and he only has act like gear on, so that really wasn't too good. But the reason I came to this warp is because... A lot of people are actually trying to dirt people while they have the GK on. So they use the GK to lure people, which is what I just jumped into that guy thinking he was trying to do. But obviously he didn't have a GK on. So I'm actually going to try and actually go for some of the people trying to lure. But obviously I'm not going to follow them into their trap. So either way, we're just trying to get into any PvP area right now and try and grab ourselves some GK gear. But I guess for now, let's actually go ahead and go spawn real quick. Here we go then, guys. Actually, I'm buying myself some freaking GK gear right here. So my boy Rillo T is actually in the selfie faction let me quickly message him thank you so i actually did just go ahead and kill a few people at warp planes and i also did kill a few people at it's not warp planes it's called icy planes so i did actually kill a few people over there then i killed a few people over at the desert thing but all of those guys were running away for so long i'm never going to bother including that because i was literally like a five minute chase and they were trying to dump me at the same time so but either way we did just try i guess we basically accomplished what we wanted to in this episode because we just bought some gk gear from the mad money we made it's when you put this guy on actually because it's not our best GK gear but it's definitely worth I guess having so wait he said he didn't have boots so he didn't sell me the boots but apart from that basically got everything so it's 10k per piece we actually I guess came out of that with a better deal I think but it also had overload 3 on him by the way on the actual set which is kind of sick it's gonna go ahead and dip into the walls and once again see if we can find a few other people now that we actually have GK gear and everything we actually should be good and actually trying to kill some decently overpowered people so I actually want to take this sword with me, actually doesn't, yeah, the custom enchants of these guys are bad by the way, but the reason I bought them is because it is going to help me out with some early PvP, trying to fight the other guys that purchase G kits, which is definitely a challenge early on, so let's actually see if there's anybody around here that's actually somewhat OP that we can try and challenge, so that was definitely dope, we could try and get a few kills right there, and I actually ended up purchasing even some more gear on top of that from that guy from Selfie, which is sick, but let's actually see. Is there anybody actually around here? We've got this guy over here who I don't actually have an axe on me to actually kill. So there you go. I don't know why he's actually not trying to kill me anything back either. But let's kill this guy as well. Just for some extra sword levels. He's shifting but I'm still happy to do it dude because it's the war zone. Let's actually check behind us. There's actually a bunch of people sitting there for no reason to fight any of these guys. So let's actually go ahead and just head all the way back then. So I actually have my unarmed actually to level up. So I probably should start hitting this guy over here. Or if he actually runs away, okay, you know what, I don't even care, just let him go away. So the main intention here is to grab even more G kit than we have already done. And I guess we also could try and find, okay, that guy TP'd out instantly or even logged out, I don't even know. But the goal right now is also to find some more people who could try and sell us some G kit gear. Because the one that we just bought already wasn't the best gear, but it was definitely something to keep us entertained for a while. And to actually keep us on our feet in the war zone. So that definitely does help out a lot. Literally, I've actually seen so many times like the thing pop up in chat, like literally just right now, and I haven't seen anyone in the war zone, which feels kind of weird because these guys must have some really nice spots to redeem their thing, which does suck for me, meaning I can't actually locate them. But it also is great for them, meaning these guys can actually grab what they paid for and not actually lose it. But this actually would be kind of sick if we could kill someone that had that thing on them, or even a rank voucher, that'd be sick as well. But 
currently we aren't really seeing anything even those guys that are naked in walls and i killed those guys as well just in case they have one of those on them as well would be really cool kind of like a surprise thing but nobody really does that in the walls and i don't see why anyone would carry that literally in the middle of the walls and but i guess for now let's just carry on and try and locate a few more people so we've got this guy over here he does have, I guess, what is that on him? So he just had ender pearls and a shovel on him. So nothing really too good there. He did get a sword level off him, which is kind of sick. But apart from that, we didn't really get much out of that. So if I just do MC and if I do axes real quick, so you guys can see right here. Oh, this guy actually has the voucher for that thing, I think. Yes, yeah, so he just has to right click that and I guess he can start. And there you go. I think he just did it. But apart from that, we actually have our thing right here. It's so axes. So I do want to go ahead and level this guy off in a little bit. I could. I feel bad for this guy, but I do level up my unarmed the little. <laughs> oh my god, dude. It's literally the walls in, dude. Okay, I'll kill the guy behind him. He ended up anyway. So let's go ahead and kill this guy and see if we can. There you go. Unarmed is level 12. Nice. So you do want to get your unarmed to level 1000 so you can actually go ahead and not get unarmed, which is the worst thing about it. So this guy over here is what I was trying to level up our unarmed and him. Okay, that guy's the same guy as before. Not really seeing anybody with actual gear on right now, which kind of does suck, but. Guess it doesn't matter too much. Let's go ahead and just combo this guy up as well. Go ahead and give him a little, I guess, give myself a nice little boost of MC MMO. And apart from that, okay, as soon as I get out of combat, I'll just get out of here because I do want to go ahead and try to find a few people with gear, like I said. Would be really cool if we could find even what this dude literally, what's the point? Is he not? Alright, I just killed that guy by accident. I didn't even mean to one shot him, but he's wearing nothing. So, yeah, as soon as I get out of combat, we are actually going to go ahead, head back to spawn, and probably. Maybe even check out a few of the walks if we still don't see anyone because right now there's a crap ton of people online and I do believe a lot of these guys are camping out at warps and these guys literally keep tagging me in combat. This guy's a trainee so he shouldn't be coming back after doing that so right, there you go dude that was your own fault. So can I literally finally get out of combat now? Right, yeah literally we're still not finding anything. I've actually been running now for a little while. I'm literally, like, I can't see anything dude. Nothing is spawning around me. I'm hearing the fireworks off in the distance but... Those are literally people looting their own ones as well, so I can't really try and get any of those. So even if I do turn my volume up, it's not really going to help me, because even when I run in the direction, I'm still not finding any of these guys. Before you guys comment it, literally, before you guys do it, oh, let's kill this guy, maybe he has something on him. Okay, yeah, dude, dude died from the lava first, and bang. So he didn't have, it looks like that guy didn't actually have any... What's it called? Envoy stuff on him. So what the hell just came on me? I had some random guy who just decided to hit me. Is that mine? Oh, shotgun raid spirit. So, okay, that's kind of cool. But right, guys. I think I actually am going to go ahead and wrap this video up right here. Because I do need to work on the base of the rest of the faction in a little bit. So, guys, if you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, subscribe for new. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, everyone.